What's up everyone? Welcome to the Surfside PPC YouTube channel. Today I want to go over how to use ChatGPT to grow your YouTube channel. So I'm going to give you some simple prompts you can use and some different things that we can do to help us research things a little bit quicker, come up with video ideas a little bit faster. So we're basically just trying to be more efficient and we can use ChatGPT, the completely free version of ChatGPT to do all of this. So you can see I've already made a lot of my prompts here into ChatGPT. So let's come back over here and Let's start with eight different things you can do with ChatGPT to help with your YouTube channel. Now there's plenty more things you can do. I wanted to keep this pretty simple because I didn't want to do 100 different things you can do with ChatGPT to help your YouTube channel. So eight different things and I have nine different prompts for you that you can use. So number one, come up with keywords and topics for your YouTube ideas. And number two, gonna be pretty similar but use keywords to come up with even more video ideas. So what I mean by that is if we come over here to ChatGPT, the example I'm going to be using today is let's just say I have a YouTube channel about WordPress. So I want to create more WordPress content and I start with what are 30 popular WordPress keywords I can target with YouTube videos. Now if you make this prompt, what you can do is once you get these 30 different keywords, you can say can you give me 30 more WordPress keywords that I can target with YouTube videos and you'll have a total of 60 keywords very, very quickly. So let's scroll down here and you can see they're going to give us some more information here keywords cover a wide range of topics so you can kind of use this as well to come up with some more ideas even but what I, you can do is basically say let's copy and paste all of these keywords below and put can you use the 30 keywords below and turn each keyword into a youtube video idea so if we scroll down you can see each of these different types of video ideas match up with a lot of the different keywords that are up here at the top so for wordpress optimization if we scroll down you could see WordPress optimization, seven tips to speed up your website. So not only are you targeting the keyword WordPress optimization, you now have a topic for your video. So in addition to that, what you could also do is come down here and say, I wanna start making some videos about WordPress plugins. So that was one of the keywords at the top. So I could say, can you give me 10 YouTube video ideas for WordPress plugins? And these are 10 unique video ideas. So how to install and activate WordPress plugins, the top 10 must have WordPress plugins for your website, and then kind of breaking it down in some different subcategories. SEO plugins, WordPress plugins, WordPress security plugins. So it makes it a little bit easier to come up with all these different content ideas. So once you have some of your keywords up here, you can say, can you give me 10 video ideas about WordPress themes? And they're gonna say, here are 10 different video ideas about how to use WordPress themes. And they might say, here are the best e-commerce WordPress themes. Here are the best magazine style WordPress themes. Here are the best themes for news websites. So you're able to kind of come up with a lot of different video ideas just by using chat GPT. And I've been doing this more often and it's really helped me get a lot more ideas for my channel, things that I can create this year. So as we keep scrolling down here, one more prompt that I use. So we have the 10 video ideas for WordPress plugins. I did a YouTube video outline, but below that one, let's just say I wanted to create a video about WordPress security plugins. I have what are the five best WordPress security plugins, and they'll give me really good WordPress security plugins here. So now I have everything I need to basically start making my video. I just have to go through each one of these individual plugins, pull up the websites, and then go over some of the different benefits, pros and cons of these different WordPress security plugins. So coming back over here, the first two things, actually this is kind of the first three things, come up with keywords and topics for your YouTube video ideas. Use your keywords to come up with even more video ideas by saying, can you give me some video ideas for WordPress plugins, for whatever some of these different keywords are. And then you can find that detailed information by saying, what are the best WordPress security plugins? What are 10 WordPress plugins that every single website owner should use? And I've also pulled out some of the prompts as well, and I'll put these in the video description so you can easily use them if you want to, but what are 30 popular blank keywords I can target with YouTube videos? Can you use the 30 keywords and turn each keyword into a YouTube video idea? Use keywords from your first prompt, you can paste them directly into that prompt as well. Can you create a YouTube video outline? So that's a little bit separate. That's what I'm gonna be going over next. So let's come back over here generating video outlines and video scripts and you can also use those video scripts using AI text-to-speech or text-to-video tools. This is not something I do for my channel but it is something that you can do if you're trying to automate your video creation process a little bit. So coming back over here let's scroll up. The two things I did here is let's just say one of the keywords I pulled out was WordPress permalinks. So I have can you create a YouTube video outline for a video about WordPress permalinks. 
I've been doing this a lot for YouTube video outlines. The main reason why I like doing it in chat GPT, I'll also just basically do keyword research for a lot of the topics that I'm covering. But with the video outline, what they're gonna do is give you all sorts of different ideas for things that you may have not thought of. Troubleshooting common permalink issues. So here are some of the different issues people are facing. Let me make sure I cover that in my video. And then you can see here some best practices for WordPress permalinks, making sure that we are going over some of the best practices and why it's really important for search engine optimization. So I really like using outlines for specific topics that I'm covering just to basically see, okay, make sure you cover this in your video. I don't follow each outline exactly as it is, but it is helpful to kind of see, okay, let me make sure I go over how to change default permalinks, some of the drawbacks of using the default permalinks. So I try to go through some of the different things in the outline to say, okay, let me make sure I cover this in detail because it may have been something I might not have been planning to cover for that video. So scrolling down here, you can also see, can you use the outline above? So using the outline above to generate a YouTube video script for a video about WordPress permalinks. So you can see they give me a script here now this is where you can start using some text to video or text to speech tools. Some of the different ones I pulled up, I just pulled up a couple different, I don't use these, so I don't have a lot of expertise in what the absolute best text to video AI generators are, but I found this post on the first page of Google. If we scroll down here, you can see a list of the best text to video AI generators. So all of these different tools here, obviously it's up to you to research and figure out which one works the best for your business and for your needs. But there's also some more here, neilchasefilm.com. So we'll scroll down and they have some different ones here as well. Best overall, best for realistic human avatars, best for social media videos. So depending on what you need it for, these tools can be very helpful to kind of outsource some of these different videos that you wanna make. Now you can also do text to speech as well. So if we come over here, I found a article on victorytale.com, best AI voice generators, text to speech. If we scroll down, they have a list here as well. So murph.ai, synthesis, play.ht, lovo.ai, synthesia, so, and other alternatives. Honestly, I don't really know what the best ones are to use, so I'm not gonna give you any recommendations because I don't have enough experience using them, but you can find scripts very easily by just simply asking ChatGPT. You can use the video outline here, or if we scroll down, I did another one, so can you give me a full video script for a YouTube video that answers the question, what are WordPress permalinks? That's where I think video scripts are gonna be a little bit better answering specific questions, because if you're asking it to cover a topic in detail, you may not get a full script that's gonna cover a topic in detail. But in this case, you can see even when they give you a script, opening shot of a computer screen with a WordPress website displayed on it. Introduction, hey everyone, welcome to our video. What are WordPress permalinks? So you can kind of, use your video editing expertise and use any of the video content that you've created and then use some of these different scripts throughout your video as well. So it makes it a little bit easier if you're trying to come up with the actual video content that you wanna to publish to your YouTube channel. So coming back over here, some of the different prompts for that. Can you give me, can you create a YouTube video outline for a video about blank? Can you give me a full video script for a video about blank? And the next thing I'm gonna go over is how to come up with some video titles, tags, and descriptions. Now, if we come over here, the next thing you're gonna see, so generate video titles, descriptions, and tags. So there are some really easy prompts that you can use for this as well as we scroll down. Can you give me YouTube video titles for a video about WordPress permalinks? What I like is they're just gonna give you some different things here where WordPress permalinks explain how to customize your URL structure. So common issues, SEO tips, everything you need to know about WordPress permalinks. So it gives you some different ideas for titles if you wanna make it look a little bit better than just saying WordPress permalinks 2023. Now next, if we scroll down YouTube video descriptions, I'm gonna go over this after the tags. So you can say, can you give me YouTube video tags for a video about WordPress permalinks? They give me this tags here. What I could do is say, can you give me 10 more tags? And they'll give me 10 more tags. So if you wanna keep finding more and more tags, you can keep asking chat GPT. Now what I like doing, you can see here, can you use the outline below to write a YouTube video description? So what I did is I pulled the outline from the top here. So the outline they gave us earlier up here about a YouTube video about WordPress permalinks. So keep scrolling down here. I'll make sure I'm showing you the right thing. Right here I asked, can you give me a YouTube video description for a video about WordPress permalinks? And you can see 
that it only gave me about a paragraph of content. So it's not really that detailed of a video description. So what you could do is take that outline and ask for a YouTube video description using the detailed outline. And what you're gonna get is a much longer YouTube video description here. We can basically copy and paste this into YouTube. So it makes it a lot easier to write our video descriptions. Generally what I'll do is I'll read through these, change anything that doesn't sound right. Sometimes I'll add headings and say, okay, here's how to do this for SEO. Here's a summary of the video. So trying to make it a little bit easier in the video description because writing a long video description and then trying to write a blog post in addition to creating your video and coming up with tags, sometimes it's easier to make this a little bit more efficient for ourselves. So coming back over here, that is how you can generate video titles, descriptions, and tags. You can continue to ask for more titles. You can use prompts, for example. Can you give me 10 different video titles? Can you give me 20 tags for a video about blank? Coming over here, you can see, can you give me a YouTube video description for a video about blank? But if you do use that outline like I showed you, it's gonna give you a more detailed description generally. Now the next thing is going to be answering comments. Can you answer this in a couple of sentences? So coming back to the next thing we can do is answering questions from the comments section. So sometimes it can be really difficult to keep up with comments. I know for me it really is. So what you could do is use ChatGPT and say, can you answer this in a couple of sentences? How can I make them more SEO friendly in WordPress? And what I would recommend doing is not just copying and pasting this, but basically rewriting the question so it sounds like a human actually wrote it. Because sometimes these, to make permalinks SEO friendly in WordPress, you can use a custom permalink structure. So you can basically just say, you can try using a custom permalink structure and then make sure you're using keywords that relate to your content rather than just using the default structure when you set up WordPress. So making sure that it sounds more natural, this is why I wouldn't recommend publishing all of your content directly from these different chat tools and AI tools without going through it because it doesn't sound exactly like a human is writing it or talking. But if we can answer more qu more comments much quicker and answer these questions much quicker, especially for questions that ChatGPT can easily answer, and plenty of people are going to ask those types of questions, especially if you're covering something like WordPress. So very easy to come in here and answer more of your comments. So last but not least, playlists and video series ideas. This is something I haven't used as much, but definitely something I'm gonna try using to make sure I'm creating comprehensive content about the topics I'm creating videos for. But you can just say, what are some playlist ideas for a YouTube channel that covers WordPress? And you can see they give me 10 different playlist ideas. So some really good ideas here too, WordPress themes. So if I start creating a bunch of different videos about themes, I can add them all to this playlist. If I create a bunch of different videos about plugins, like I said, all those different plugin video ideas before. So you can see a playlist featuring all of those videos. Makes it much easier to rank higher in the YouTube search engine when you are covering all these topics comprehensively. And then you could even put together all of your videos at the end and say, here's the ultimate guide to WordPress plugins. Watch my two hour long video where I go over every single plugin for every reason that you would need to do pretty much anything on your website from security to SEO. So the next thing and the last thing that I'm gonna cover today is what is a YouTube video series that I can create about WordPress? So one YouTube video series could be WordPress for beginners, goes over the basics, setting up a website, uh, choosing a domain name, finding a hosting provider, installing WordPress, configuring your settings, creating pages, creating posts, installing themes. So the very basics of WordPress. And then what I could do is what is a YouTube video series I can create for advanced users of WordPress? And they're gonna give me a much better series idea for people that are actually using WordPress and that maybe wanna take all of their WordPress knowledge to the next level. So coming back over here to finish off the video, what we can see here is the last couple chat GPT prompts. What is a YouTube video series I can create about blank? What are some playlist ideas for a YouTube channel about blank? Now the very last thing I wanna go over in this video is there is a pretty good um, YouTube Chrome extension with chat GPT. You can install it on Chrome. You can see here is the URL glasp.co slash YouTube summary it's called. You can find it directly in the Chrome Web Store through the extensions YouTube Summary with ChatGPT. So what I did is I went into my own video, Google Keyword Planner Tutorial for 2022. I've actually updated this video for 2023. But if you do install this Chrome extension and you go to Transcript and Summary, they will give the complete transcript here. And if you click 
They're going to give you an AI summary. So you just have to sign into chat GPT. It's going to give the full transcript here for my video. So very, very long transcript. And then they give you a quick summary to go over what it's about. Now, what you could do is say, can you summarize this in four paragraphs? Can you summarize this in 500 words? You can ask ChatGPT to pretty much do anything for you. So if you want to say, I want to create a video about the Google Keyword Planner, but I don't know where to get started. Use a tool like this, find the transcript and summary, copy and paste the transcript. Well, you don't even have to copy and paste the transcript. You just click this button here. It will paste that transcript there and then just ask ChatGPT, can you please go over everything that's covered in this transcript? Can you give me a video outline for Google Keyword Planner? So all of that makes it very helpful to kind of organize your ideas and organize your thoughts before you start creating videos. So to finish everything out, here are the ChatGPT prompts that I use today to find all sorts of things for a YouTube channel. A lot of things that I'm already using for my own YouTube channel. Try not to outsource too much. I don't use any of the uh, text to speech or text to video, but and I don't use video scripts either, but it does, it does become helpful when you organize your thoughts a little bit better before a video and try to find everything you need to know about a topic so you can cover it comprehensively. If you have any questions about using ChatGPT to grow your YouTube channel, leave them in the comment section. Thanks for watching my video today and make sure you subscribe to the Surfside PPC YouTube channel.